Welcome back. One cup of coffee, one cup of syrup, bay leaf and orange peel, half cup cocoa powder. Let's get started adding our one cup of coffee and the peel and the bay leaf. Then I am going to add my syrup, one cup of my homemade syrup, the link would be above, and chocolate powder. Going to give this a whisk and let it come to a boil. I am not adding any thickener to this, but if you wish you can, but I am not going to. I'm just going to let this boil down and once it is thick, I'm going to let it cool. And you will see naturally how nice and thick this has become. And I'm not adding pure sugar, raw sugar, sorry, but I'm using the syrup, my homemade syrup, extra flavor to this. So once it has come to a boil and it, uh, it is at a thickness that I would like, I am going to let that cool. Once it has come to room temperature, after cooling, you would see how thick it has become. And as I said, you can add your thickener if you wish to speed up the process. So it is almost cool. So let me show you a close look at what it looks like. You might say to yourself, but this is not thick. But just wait. Once it is completely cooled, you will see how thick this is. And that cocoa powder, so rich and nice, it was unbelievable, ladies and gentlemen. <music> I am pouring it in the container and I am telling you once this is totally cool you will totally see the difference in this and by the time I got around to go and fill the other jar this was the consistency of my chocolate syrup you can totally see once it is cooled completely how thick it has become without any sort of thickening agents in this again if you wish you can to speed along the thickening process you can add your thickening agent but i didn't add any in this process and you can clearly see how much it has thickened up thank you so much for watching my homemade chocolate syrup today i am making some roasted tomato and salt fish or salted cod